When it comes to placing links on our page, the anchor text or the phrase that you can click on that takes you to the destination page plays a far greater role than most people imagine. For example, let's do a Google search for the term click here. You will notice that the first result is for Adobe Reader. Nowhere on the Adobe site does click here appear, yet it ranks number one for the term. The reason for this is because many other websites, including very high authority sites such as educational institutions, link to this exact page and the anchor they use is click here. I want to show another good example of anchor text that will really illustrate how the anchors influence the results in searches. As you can see here, this particular anchor is actually a typo. Instead of typing aptorial, this webmaster accidentally typed in aptoria. Also take note of the destination URL for this link. Let's see what happens when we search for the term aptoria in Google. You will notice that in the results, the exact page that had the link for aptoria appears. No other page on the aptorial site appears for this search term. When you make your site, keep this SEO tip in mind. When you link to other pages on your website, avoid using common phrases like click here or anything similar to it. Instead, use some of the keywords and phrases that you have written down. So for example, if I want to send my users to my page that talks about left-handed golf clubs, first I will set up the proper code by dragging the icon that looks like a chain link to my desired spot on the page. In this pop-up window, instead of using click here as my anchor, I will type in left-handed golf clubs and link to the appropriate page on my site. So remember, anchor text tells search engines a lot about a site. Using anchors such as click here does not help to categorize a website. Always use good keywords and phrases in your anchor text and remember to use those good anchors on other sites when linking back to your site.